What's up guys, Steve, Farm Guy Barbecue. Today we're gonna be cooking some cowboy cornbread in a Dutch oven over some hot coals and man, is it good. Y'all go check out that link above. That's the cowboy chili that we're gonna be eating this cornbread with. All right, y'all say hi to my man, Mason. Hi. So what do you think the best ingredient's gonna be in this cornbread? Honey. Honey? That's mine too. Fresh, natural, raw Texas honey makes it a world of difference. A lot of folks just use sugar. I like to add just a little bit of sugar and then combine it with some of that local honey. You guys use as much as you want to your taste and man, is it good. It just really adds that extra something to the cornbread and folks just love it. Ingredients are down below in the description. And when you guys have any questions at all, drop them into the comments section. I wanna know if y'all make this. Y'all let us know if you like it. We've already got the dry ingredients here. we got the wet ingredients here. We're gonna put some butter in a 10 inch cast iron Dutch oven and then we're gonna pour it in, we're gonna get cooking. All right, y'all check that consistency out. Oh yeah. Well, y'all let me know, what's your favorite extra ingredient in cornbread? I know a lot of folks like to use things like cheese, jalapenos, uh, green chilies. I've heard of a lot of cool different things to put in cornbread. That's one of the things that makes cornbread so cool is because you can kind of make it your own. So y'all let me know, what, what's your favorite thing to put in cornbread? Y'all say hi to beautiful. Hey guys. So the next step, we got our pot preheated to somewhere between 400, 425. Y'all check it out. Oh yeah. The next thing you wanna do is you wanna put some coals on that lid, because remember, we're baking this time, so we need to cook from the top and from the bottom. You can tell when it's really starting to get done on the bottom because it really starts to pull away from the sides and then the top's probably not gonna be done at the same time. That's why we take it off the heat, leave the coals on the top. And then I like to use the good old toothpick test. If the toothpick comes out clean, cornbread's ready. All right, y'all look at that good cornbread. There's a nice little crust on there. And man, that is just so good and so moist, y'all. I'm really happy how this cornbread turned out. Moment of truth. That little crunch on the top, really moist in the middle. That's good, y'all. That is really good. That's real good. We're about to dig into some chili. Remember, y'all go check out that other video too. Ingredients for this recipe are down below. Love you guys. God bless.